<laughs> Logan. <laughs> Richard. Wow, this is a pleasant surprise. Hmm. Finn, Colin, you know Richard, don't you? Well, hello, boys. Nice to see you. Logan, I wanted to talk to you. I just heard about the incident. The... I heard that you professed your feelings for Rory. What? Mr. Bell is a very dear friend of mine, as is the Dean of Admissions. Well, you know this place. News travels fast. Yeah, look. I have to tell you that while I understand what could have driven you to such a public display of affection, there is a proper time and place for that sort of thing. And a classroom in the middle of class is not one of them. No, I know. I... Uh, However, I... what's done is done. It's out. So, I dropped by to tell you that I've spoken to your father. My father? Well, we pounded out a few things. Property agreements, prenups, that sort of thing. Okay, I think that there's oh, been... we came to a very fair agreement. I'm sure you'll be pleased. Now, we're setting up a dinner for next week to finalize the engagement and start talking about the ceremony. Emily is handling all the newspaper announcements, so not to worry, that's all taken care of. Oh, but... She is a fine young lady, Logan. I want her to be happy. You'll take care of that, I assume. All right, uh, I'll let you get back to your coffee break. Nice seeing all of you again. And Logan, welcome to the family, son. I do hope one of his dopey-looking friends knows CPR, or he just might not make it. You're the best, Grandpa. <laughs> All right, who's next? Paris giving you any trouble? Not any more than usual. However, there is a girl in my modern poetry class who keeps kicking my chair. Ah, I do love this place. Right back at you, Grandpa. <laughs>